Good evening everyone, GLevel7 here and today we're going to have an update video regarding the channel in general and I just want to say that uh, my class is about to start on September 14th so even though I have about two weeks to take a break I feel like it's about um, the time that I'm going to have to talk about what's going to happen to this channel because um, it might drastically change. So I've been looking through my YouTube videos and we got like a couple things in um, the works like like um, having Bloons Monkey City content and Pokemon content. And regarding Bloons, I don't think I have anything important to cover and in terms of Pokemon I believe I have one playlist pending to be working on that is that is Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Nuzlocke in Japanese that's going to be put on hold because I doubt I'll be able to finish recording every day and get it uploaded every day on YouTube that's too much to ask for because I'm actually working every day and there's almost no sense of getting free time or having a day off or two. It's always going to be in the working facility doing required work. So that's why I didn't have much motivation left to play. Like whenever I get home like around 10 or 11 p.m. I always get very tired. I just don't give a damn about recording or something like that and that's sometimes pretty bad but if I wanted to preserve my health then I gotta take every step necessary to make myself feel better and not having to be stressed with every single thing that's gonna happen in life I just don't want that to happen I um YouTube is to me it's not a primary job is a, it's just a hobby it's something that I record what I enjoy and I post it there and if you enjoy it too that's great if not well there's many other stuff you can watch and that's exactly what happens to the sub count it's like you can't really blame them it's like some rise and some fall like for example I had like 50 51 52 and then 51 50 and 49 like, oh well, the, the 50 sub special is already there, so there's nothing for me to, to try and change it. Like, I mean, I can change the title and then it's like, oh, it's no longer 50 sub special because it's no longer having 50 subs. Like, hmm, what am I, I lost my train of thought there, but. <clears throat> Having a minor sword throw doesn't help either. <laughs> but yes, that's what's going to happen on between the middle of September and the end of November, which is probably on Thanksgiving. And the good news is that Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, or actually no, Pokemon Super Mystery Dungeon is coming out on November 20th, which is one week before its finals exam. Which I wish they could have released it a little bit later so that I don't have to worry about getting it on the first day when it's released. But I did tell my local retailer that I'm going to pick it up later on like one week after the final exam ends so that I don't have to think about it being extremely hyped. And that's the problem about hyping up on other stuff that I just stray away from the important stuff and... Who knows, maybe they might make me take the class again because I screwed up on the test or something like that. Which is never a good thing. So I had to, I have to take care of what's important first. So that means that uploads will be very, very infrequent. Like, like what I'm asking for is please don't expect too much from me between... September to November because I may not be able to post content because I have to put my time into studying and other 
and work and other important life relay stuff um youtube as a hobby can just be placed aside i have no i have nothing to desire for youtube at the moment so yeah i mean it's kind of like a mixed good and bad news the the good news is well besides pokemon mystery dungeon game coming out those this quarter class that is about 10 weeks duration i only have four classes left to take and after that i'm about to get my bachelor's degree so this is very important regarding my life so i can't mess i can't screw up this opportunity because maybe next quarter those classes may not be available and the graduation ceremony might be delayed and maybe the application form will be rejected because i haven't met the requirements and everything well it hasn't gone downhill yet it's just creating some sort of delay and just wish you just wish you have done it sooner so that's what's going on in school <laughs> and way back when i started youtube i wasn't even thinking about having view counts or sub counts or or having monetize or anything it's just me creating an account and watching other people's stuff and liking it and commenting it just like to enjoy and then for some reason after a couple of let's plays that it somehow inspired me to um to do what i enjoy it's just like oh i'm joining in this community and see if we can add a another set of roster there with our with our name on top <laughs> oh shoot there's a bfb on round 14 are you kidding me oh yeah that's i'm playing a 770 um city cash reward tile i shouldn't be surprised oh yeah oh i forgot i wasn't talking not supposed to talk about bloon smuggy city stuff this is just and this is mostly an update channel because this is what I'm talking about most of the time because I want to give everyone a heads up as to as to what's going on in the future of this channel and if I don't tell them anything then maybe people might be thinking oh this youtuber has mysteriously disappeared and they just consider this channel to be dead <laughs> Oh, there's two and a half years of activity, activity, and now he's no longer doing it. Maybe he should donate his channel. Yeah, maybe I should. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I should donate it. <laughs> Actually, no, I don't want to donate my channel. I want to keep it for future, future stuff like keeping track of people that I always like to watch, like regarding any kind of content that I'm interested in, whether it be Pokemon, Bloons, television shows, or anything else. Anyways, this is the second time. Actually, I'm done with talking about the update now. So yeah, back to Bloons Monkey City and I don't know, I'm just picking a random tile that I feel like I want to play. And this one in particular, I had to play it twice because the first time I did it, the computer crashed. And the progress is not saved, obviously. And now it's just me repeating, playing the same track again. <laughs> but this is, a, this is actually a pretty easy track, so you shouldn't have any difficulty there. You got like an Arctic Wind, a Rank 5 Arctic, Rank 5 uh, Ice Monkey, no, Monkey Knowledge Pack Bow. It increases its uh, radius by a lot. Like it's even more than a dart monkey. Anyways, anybody wondering, oh, why am I having very few towers? You might get overwhelmed eventually. Well, I'm trying to save up for the, I'm trying to save up for Spectre. It pops blooms a lot effectively without much lag, unlike the Sun God. And I was watching one bloom science video from Super Jumbombo and he said the Spectre the Spectre can pop a lot of balloons than the Sun God. Like he clicked on the, I think he had an auto clicker or some sort, and he clicked twenty seconds worth of ceramics, and he compared them between the the Sun God and the um, and the Spectre. And the Spectre pop almost forty eight thousand balloons, 
while the Sun God pops only 19,000 balloons. And probably the Sun God um, popped less balloons because the ceramic has the ceramic shell has 10 layers. No, I mean not 10 layers, 10, 10 hits to pop the layer. So that's why it takes a while. But it's accurate. It, it, can, it fires three streams. It has a popping power of 15. It fires three streams. And it can like aim whatever it wants to. The Spectre is just... Um, it still aims very good, but... But in order to make the maximum impact for the accuracy, I'm guessing you have to place the spectre where it won't get where it won't get overwhelmed. Let's say that for example if those all those ceramics are right here, then it'll cause the spectre to become confused and it doesn't know exactly what it's going to shoot. But it still does a perfect job there. So it's less lag. It's getting more pops than the super monkey. So it took me a couple tries to watch Super John Bumble's BT um Bloom BTD science videos to have a feel about oh which tower can do a better job or something. Anyways, we're almost done with this track. We only have like about five rounds left. He is popping those uh, Moab class balloons without lag. Oh, see the first Moab pack, it took it down a lot easily. So yes, so uh, if once September 14 rolls, then that's when the update's going to take effect because the school is about to start. At least in the university, I, th I believe other schools like elementary or high school, they already started on, they already started on the 17th of August to which to where I live at. But I heard from one of my university professors that they're going to change from a quarter to a semester system. So it's going to be slow rather than fast. I kind of like the quarter a lot because it only takes 11 weeks to end a session, to end the quarter class. While semester, I think it's about 15 or 16 weeks, including the final exam. So it's kind of a bit slowed down. Anyways, the cash is coming in a lot quickly. We're getting so much city, I mean not city, we're getting so much cash from all these Moab pack tiles because they just try to overwhelm your defenses. And there we go. I hope it doesn't crash. Come on, please give me that tile. Yes, thank you. Okay, so that's going to be it for the update and me playing a random tile in Bloons Monkey City because I feel like it. And I was thinking of doing the face cam, but I don't feel like I don't feel like doing it in front of everyone because probably my my gestures or expressions might look like it's crap. But anyways, <laughs> that's all I have for you for this update. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.